What up, y'all? Preach. Thank you for showing up. Yeah. I didn't say it. Like and subscribe. Anyway, uh, <clears throat> excuse me. Just choking. Uh, this happened December 24th. I know. I'm late. Whatever. I, th- I saw it on that day. And I was looking at it. And I was like... And I read... Uh, and You know, I'm, I'm going to say thanks to... I think it was Dirt Griggity. Uh, no, it was uh, the TTS Talk That Shizzle podcast on YouTube. It was Dirt Griggity and Sean uh, 786, I think, or I forget the numbers, and other people, Tsunami or whoever else is on that panel. And they did, they went through this stuff. And I was like, oh my God. I, I had to, I had to, I had to do a little quick. This is going to be a quick, quick, quickity quick. I always say that, but this is going to be quickity quick. But basically, what happened was your boy, uh, Black. Your boy, Black Hokage, uh, was on G4 TV with, with Adam Sessler and a couple other people, and he was saying, PlayStation 5 ain't got no games right now, yo, blah, 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 or something like that. You know, paraphrasing the course, right? Then Hip Hop says this. Hip Hop Gamer. You know Hip Hop Gamer. You know, you remember him with the, the belt, the spinny, remember that? He disappeared for a minute, right? I guess he's trying to come back and get the, I don't know what's going on. Anyway, he says this. Hold up, I heard that G4 TV was back, right? Then I heard my man, the Black Hokage, say the PlayStation 5 needs some games. Dog, be real. That sounds like something a non-gamer would say. Don't be that troll, bro. You better than that, son. PlayStation 5 has tons of games, clearly. Number one for a reason. First, him saying number one, PlayStation number one is his opinion obviously uh two the history of hip-hop gamer is that he was a super playstation dude during playstation 3 um and he was all about graphics 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 he's really a graphics whore at heart but he is a pony as well i'm just, I'm just saying he's a pony he's a donkey unicorn he may not show it he may th- pretend that he's above it and greater and whatever a responsible human being and all that stuff uh because he doesn't go off like he used to because he's changed a little bit of his ways you know but it's still in there you know what i mean and so black hokage says this i've been in the same room as you several times and now once have you spoken to me i mentioned the ps5 and it doesn't have many games and i'm interested that i i'm interested in at the moment and here you are talking tough you don't add anyone else from x play just a black man you are certified cornball i saw that i was like "Ooh, cornball yo what's what's up with that is that what's going on here and then he says, this man trying to start shit with someone because they don't mention you can play PS4 titles on the 5. Newsflash, nobody bought a next-gen console for that. Outside of Ratchet and & Clank and Returnal, the 5 doesn't have much to offer. Doesn't mean I want to see it fail. I want more goof. I want more games goofy. <laughs> so, like, every last word of his post is a... It's an insult, basically. But he said cornball, and he said goofy. <laughs> and at that point, I was like, okay, this is, <laughs> this is starting to get funny. And then he goes back. Oh, I forgot. Hip Hop had, had a response. He said, bro, I saw the clip of you, dog. What else was said? Two. Dog, we talking games. Like you calling me a cornball, dog. It's not that serious. Fall back. Three, stop lying. I spoke to you, dog. We was on the same panel with Microsoft, and I show you mad love like I do everyone. Like I said, Hip Hop Game returned over a new leaf back in the day, uh, but it doesn't negate the fact that he's a, he's a pony, right? Black Hokage says, watch the whole video. We agreed PS5 lacked exclusives, but you only added the black man on the panel we supposed to stick together playstation 5 lacks exclusives get out your feelings we were on a panel but i never spoke directly to you you are a cornball <laughs> i'm like yo this cat black hokage don't play he's just like Psh. you know what remember remember last gen when y'all were talking all that shit remember that mm. here's that me- here's that medicine real quick boop boop Black Hokage continues. A 40-something-year-old washed game 
gaming journalist with a ding <laughs> digi do rag. All right, let me give you that. <laughs> a forty-something-year-old washed gaming journalist with a dingy do rag and wrestling belt trying to beef with me because I said PlayStation Five likes exclusives on Xmas, y'all. It just, it just keeps on coming. And hip hop says some more stuff. He says, "Dog, see you, t- see you taking this way out of context, bro. I'll handle this another way. In terms of this, black people stick together. You'd be surprised at how many times I mentioned your name and pushed for you to get certain opportunities when I was asked. You should be picked. God bless, man. One. So he's trying to take the higher road. Props to him for that, I guess. But once again." The breed of fandom is different this generation. No longer are the ex-bots, if you will, just pushovers. It's like, oh, we could, you know, we could talk shite to them because they ain't got nothing. They ain't got no games and consoles. Why? No longer is that the case. And this is what happens. Black Hokage says, you and me over five times talking reckless, saying I wouldn't respond. I did proved you wrong and instead for an apology you want to talk peace so now black santa delivering you an l merry christmas clown <laughs> i was like what yo this cat is like he took some coffee he's like let me put some uh-huh and some coffee and some boop ba doop and dynamite or something he's boys on fire he's like nope ain't no ponies getting up in my vicinity i, I can't box uh, and he he apologized for the toxicity. <laughs> he says Apologi- apologies for the toxicity on the timeline. That shizzle just pissed me off because it's the holidays and this man is constantly adding me because I said the PS5 lacks exclusive. Everyone in the X-Play video agreed, but he only called out another black man in the industry. Not only is he stupid and wrong, but I'll ne- I've never been in the same room with this man at events several times and he has never had a man-to-man conversation with me. But then he's talking reckless on Twitter the first chance he got. This stuff, this, the stuff I'd be talking about, mofo's dead-ass weirdo. That's what's up. And that was, that was basically the end of that. Um, and I was like, yo, that was pretty entertaining. Because remember, back in the day, Hip Hop Gamer was number one pony. He, y'all don't understand. If y'all don't realize, y'all don't understand. Hip hop gamer used to go to the E3, the PlayStation events, the PlayStation press conference at E3, and he would be up there with his belt. They would put him in the front row. And they would have a camera on him, and he would be jumping up, hollering like I like a cheer leader. And I'm not exaggerating. He'd be like, "Whoa!" You can hear you. Jack trying to be up on stage like yes and the PS5 I mean PS5 the PS4 is gonna PS3 <laughs> he left just when the PS4 was gonna, PS3 that the da, da, PS3 and they'd be like woo yeah woo you hear hip hop gamer you would hear you'd be watching Jack Trenton you hear hip hop gamer's ass I'm like come on son really is that is that necessary I mean he was a cheerleader he still is he just they don't just don't they don't let him in on E3 anymore. <laughs> They're just not having an E3 like that anymore. So you can't you can't jump up and, and do that anymore. I, I you know, honest, honestly I don't know. Maybe uh, Hot ninety uh, was Hot ninety seven. Yeah, he's on Hot ninety seven. Maybe Hot ninety seven was like, yo, uh, Gerard, you gotta you gotta chill with that because uh, you know you work here, so you acting a fool out there on that other stuff. Now, I don't know what to say, but you know, we ain't paying you for that. We paying you. But anyway, um, I give respect to Hip Hop Gamer in that he's trying to be different as far as like how he responds and, and talks to people. And I give mad respect to Black Hokage because he shouted him out. You know what I'm saying? So Hip Hop Gamer, maybe he's manipulating the situation as far as, you know, I don't know. You know, Black, Black Hokage says, yo, I never seen dude. We never talk. We never talk. We never had a man to man. Blah blah blah. You know. So I'm like, I'm taking all these things at word, right? And so hip hop says, you know, I I, I shouted you. I did that in the third. I'm like, I don't. Yeah, I don't even know of these exchanges. Where the receipts? Where the receipts? You know what I'm saying? So, but Black Hokage represents a sentiment. 
I said that before in one of my, my past videos as far as uh, PlayStation 5 deserves Hellblade 2. Is there is a sentiment of Xbox fans that have had enough. Dirk Griggity did a video about this on, on YouTube about the different Xbox fans. And he said that he was a revenge fan. And I am the same. Meaning that what happened the last generation is fuel for all the Xbox fans who are like, all right, it's our turn to, to whoop that ass. You know what I'm saying? It's our turn to do, you know what I'm saying? It's our turn. And you got to take it. If you can't, I mean, we took it last gen, so what's the difference, you know? It's, it's, it's our turn, that's it. You know, the pendulum is swinging back, it's swinging this way. It's swinging on the green side, so, you know? And hip-hop is on the blue side. As much as he wants to, you know, try to deny it or whatever, I mean, his first his first comment was just pr proof positive. I mean, you could say they're number one in, like, sales numbers of console units, Okay, but, you know, flip it. Xbox is number one in subscription services as far as streaming and, and game services, right? So, you know, what metric are you using today to, to win? That's the thing. But anyway, that's all I got. I mean, you know, it was just a funny little uh, transaction interaction. I, I, give pro I follow Black Hokage. I was like, yo. I gotta follow this fool. He's just, I, I, and I, all I saw was the clips. I didn't actually see the whole show with, with Adam Sessler and the whole thing. And this all started with the other journalist, the, the female that was on the, the panel that said, um, "Yeah, Xbox is gonna decimate," or she said something about uh, they're gonna kill PlayStation or whatever uh, in 2022. I guess that's what she said. And then that was a big thing. And then people started making fun of her because of her looks, the ponies. And I'm like, "What's why? Why?" I mean, y'all got nothing to play, so y'all gonna make fun of people because they disagree and they're trying to put... They, they're just not putting down PlayStation, but they're looking at what's going on. PlayStation's silent, and it's like, oh, okay. You know? But, yeah. Black Hokage gets mad props for just... Just... Smashing them. It was, fu it was funny. It entertained me. I was like, okay, thank you. Thank you. That, was, that was good. That was good. Once again... You think you see what's happening, right? You see how the fans, are, you know, the, the the PlayStation ponies right now, they're real quiet because they ain't got nothing to say. Got nothing to say. And, you know, once a game, once Horizon or whatever comes out, they're like, oh man, look at that. They'll be bragging about that, right? The, the one game that comes out or two games that are going to come out next year for them. That's how it is, you know? So, but anyway, I, I appreciate, appreciate you guys hanging out. Go visit the channel, like and subscribe. Go watch the On You video. I still got the other video coming up in a couple in a week or two. Doop -a doop -a doop. You know what I mean. You, you know how it is and, and, and keep keep on tilt awaiting.